Hey everybody, Ricky of Handicapping, Thoroughbred Racing from the Big A Aqueduct Race Course, Ozone Park, New York on Wednesday, December the 2nd. This is my day at the track.com, Naira, New York Racing Association Race of the Day. Let's take a look at the Race 1 opener this afternoon, folks, 12.20 p.m. Eastern Post Time. It's a mile test on the dirt track. Three-year-olds and uprates for a maiden special weight prize of some $55,000. Contenders number two, Brimstone. Number four, Super Psyche. Number five, Mascarello, and number three, Aaron Burr. Number two, Brimstone, as the top track master plus power rating this maiden field this afternoon, has produced power run performances facing better company in both of his two career starts to date, including a power run place finish in his last start. Number four, Super Psyche, takes a four-level class drop, has hit the board in power run fashion in two of his last three, missing his diploma in his second race back by just the photograph neck at the wire in a determined attempt to break his maiden. Jockey Junior Alvarado and trainer Bill Mott sent him to the post. They fit the board with nearly 50% of more than 170 entries saddled as a team to date. Race 1 summary, number 2, Brimstone, tops my contenders list today here at Aqueduct, which also includes number 4, Super Psyche, number 5, Mascarello, and number 3, Aaron Burr, 2, 4, 5, 3, and the first from Aqueduct. Monday, excuse me, Wednesday, long shots via Ponder. Let's go to Chucktown, Charlestown Races, Slots Casino, Charlestown, West Virginia, race 3, number 5, Sliding Lady, an 8 to 1 shot. Drops in class by nine track master units. Nice overall speed to the six and a half for a long sprint. Finger Lakes Race Course, race eight to six to one shot. Number four, huge asset. Drops in class by eight track master units as the overall speed leader in this allowance field. Racing at today's distance of 8.3 furlongs, that's a mile and 70 yards on the dirt. It's up back to back power and wins facing better company in both of his last two starts. So, handicapping from Aqueduct on a Wednesday, Rick Needham for dayatthetrack.com, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.